Welcome, test prisoner, to the Terra-3 penal science colony. Space criminals, political prisoners, exiled planetary leaders, you're here because the galaxy needed a place to put you, and this is it. So, who is ready to stay here until they die? Now, you already met one another on the hyperdrive over, so let me introduce myself. I'm Cave Johnson. I'm the warden around here. Attention test prisoners attempting to escape through the air ducts. I don't know what nonsense you learned on TV, but in real life, air ducts just go to the air conditioning unit. It's also pretty dusty, so if you've got as much chances are you're gonna die up there. And we'll be smelling it for weeks, because again, the air ducts aren't a secret escape hatch. They're how we ventilate the facility. Shift. A lot. I just want to get it on record that using force fields for doors in a space prison is a bad idea. You know, it would have been better regular doors with locks. Locks that don't open when the power goes out. <coughs> Man, those blue force fields look good, though. Every time I saw one, I thought, wow, I am in space. Still, though, a door made out of paper would have been better in the long run. Would have at least slowed him down for a second. Anyway, uh, anybody not escaping or shiving me, get back to work. Just a heads up, if it seems like you're walking faster than light, you're probably in a universe where light doesn't haul nearly as much ass as it does on Earth-1. The lab boys say if you insist on walking faster than light, you are 100% going to go back in time. How far? Far enough to meet your great-great-grandfather and tell him you're fired. Because guess what? I'll let you finish that thought. <laughs> 